Hello everyone, welcome to Financial Calculator Tutorial. In this video, we will show you how to use the statistics features to forecast your sales based on historical trends. Let's consider the record of sales data. With the month and sale or number of items. First month is 1000. Second month is 1121. Third month, 1306. Fourth month, 1608. Fifth month, 2059. What is the sales estimate for the sixth month? First, we get started with clearing the previous statistics registers. To do that, tap yellow shift and clear sigma. Then, we are going to enter the sales data in the table. Enter the data for the first month, enter 1, input, and 1000, then tap sigma plus. Next, let's enter data for second month. Enter 2, input, and 1121, then tap sigma plus, and so on. Now, let's do some analytics on the sales data. How many items were sold from the first to fifth month? Tap blue shift and sigma y to calculate total sold items, which are 7,094. To calculate the average of the number of sales items, tap yellow shift and average xy, then tap shift swap key. The average sale number is 1,418.8. During your entering data, the calculator is estimating the best fit regression line for your data. Now, let's estimate the number of sale items for the sixth month. Tap 6 and shift and Y hat M. The result is 2200.3. The result is not an integer since the estimation is calculated based on the best fit line. If you want to see the slope, which is M of the best fit line, tap shift, swap. The slope is 260.5. To see the correlation coefficient of the best fit line, tap shift and x hat r, then shift and swap. The correlation coefficient is 0.97. Thank you for watching. If you're interested in this amazing financial calculator app, please click the App Store link in video description. If you have any questions, please feel free to email us at support at buddycalcs.com.